Blown by wind. When someone talks about grass, you probably think about the grass that you have in your yard. This grass is usually kept quite short by mowing. But did you know that there are some other kinds of grass and similar plants that grow much taller? One example is a group of plants called rushes. They often grow in wet places and they can be several feet or more high. Cattails, also known, like, like to grow in wet places and they can also grow even higher to six, six, between 6 to 15 feet high. You have probably seen their round brown spikes of seeds at the top of long stalks. Another kind of tall grass is called pampas grass. In some parts of the world, it, on the world, it is planted as an ornamental grass, and it grows in the wild, in the southern parts of so South America. This grass can reach nearly 10 feet high, and the flowers grow in a fluffy white tuft at the top of the tall stacks. Now, these plants are very tall, but their stems are not, are not very large, so they can easily be blown by wind. Whatever way the wind is blowing, that's the way they lean. Their stems are too weak to stand up straight and tall in the wind. Of course, that's fine for grass to do, but it's not good when people are like that. Pilot was an example of this. Like a plant which is blown back and forth by the wind, Pilot was weak. Too weak to do right when people wanted him to do some, something else. He knew that Jesus was innocent and should be released, but the people wanted Jesus to be killed. So Pilate finally gave in and let them do what they wanted. We shouldn't be like Pilate or a tall piece of grass blown back and forth by the wind. Instead, if we know what is right, we should always do it, even if it seems like everyone else is doing wrong. Let's ask Jesus right now to give us courage and strength of purpose to always do what's right, no matter what others around us choose to do. The Bible says, Jesus began to speak to the multitudes concerning John. What did you go out into the wilderness to see? A reed shaken by the wind. But what did you go out to see? A prophet? Yes. Luke seven twenty four through 26 We should always be firm and strong to do what is right. 